Hey everyone, welcome to Mix It Up Art. Today we are going to be making this cute hermit crab based off of the book, A House for a Hermit Crab. So what we're gonna do is start with a blue piece of construction paper and I want you to hold it landscape style so that it's wider side to side than it is up and down. We're gonna start by decorating this to make it look like the ocean. So what I want you to do is get a white oil pastel as well as a whole bunch of cool colors. So your cool colors are your greens, your blues, and your purples. And what you're gonna do is just start by drawing some like wavy lines randomly all over your paper and also some little circles for like bubbles. And you're gonna do this with every color that you've picked out. Once you've added in little wavy lines and little circles of all the colors, you're gonna take one finger and what I want you to do is just kind of blend it into your paper. So it's almost like you're trying to erase it with your finger. And what it's gonna do is kind of soften the lines and make it just look a little more like it's underwater. And you wanna do this over every line and every circle that you drew. Next, you're gonna get a piece of manila paper. So this is kind of like a tan color. And you're gonna use a brown oil pastel. And along the bottom here, you're gonna draw, again, some wavy lines. But this time you might make some like rocks or little pebbles. Or you could do some seashells and just kind of decorate it like it's the bottom of the ocean. Maybe I'll do a little clam, the pearl, you could do that. And once you have the bottom all decorated, again, you're gonna take your finger and just kind of smear it around to make it all mush together and look like sand underwater. And once that's done, you're gonna get your scissors and what I want you to do is cut out the bottom here. So you're gonna cut kind of in like a wavy line, or you can make it straight, it doesn't really matter. And you're gonna get your glue bottle, flip over your paper, and you're just gonna add some dots of glue all around the edges. And then we'll glue it on the bottom for the ocean floor. You wanna try to line up the corners here so that everything lines up evenly, and then gently press down. All right, so next what you're gonna do is get a strip of red paper, and I want you to start by folding it in half. And you guys can use a red oil pastel for this. Um, hopefully you'll be able to see it in the video. But what we're gonna do is draw a big rainbow line. And then at the bottom of the rainbow line, you're gonna come up and down like a upside down V. And then we can get our scissors and cut it out. Now we have two little hermit crab claws. So you're also going to receive a smaller piece of red paper. And with this, you're gonna draw a big circle on it. You want it to take up most of the paper and you're gonna cut that out also. You're also going to get two circles for the eyes of your hermit crab. So before you do anything, I want you to just kind of line up where you're gonna place everything. So what I like to do is take one of the claws and place it down like it's going into the sand, and then another claw that's facing to the left off of the paper. And then I will put my circle right on top of it here. And then the eyes are gonna stick up a little bit because they always stick off of the hermit crab. And then you're gonna get your black oil pastel and you can draw two little lines going from the top of the head there up to where you're gonna put your eyeballs and then put some black circles in them for the pupils. And you can even add in a smiley face if you want to. And then we can get our glue and start gluing down. So because you already drew those lines, we're gonna start with the eyes because this will be the easiest thing. You can just put a dot of glue and right on top of that black line, you'll add one eye and then the other. And then we can glue down our claws here. And finally, we can glue down our face. And I'm gonna try to line up those little black lines so that everything lines up and then just press down to make sure everything stays in place. All right, so our hermit crab is all done, right? Oh no, he's missing a home. So let's make him a home. We're gonna go back to that 
tan sheet of paper and I want you to get your brown oil pastel again. And you're gonna start by making a swirl. So I'm gonna go around and get a little bit bigger and around, a little bigger and around, a little bigger and around. And then I'm gonna close it in. And then we're gonna take our finger and we're gonna erase it. So I'm kind of erasing in like a zigzag line. So this is how I want you to do it. So we're not actually erasing it. We're just pretending like we are. And this is gonna smear it around and make it look like a real hermit crab shell. All right, so now we have to cut it out. And finally add some glue to the back. We can flip it over. And we wanna look for the area where the um, circle, where that swirl kind of meets right here. And this is where we wanna put it towards the head area. So I'm gonna turn it so it's sideways so that way it's like he's peeking out of this area right there. And that's it. This is our cute hermit crab from A House for a Hermit Crab. I hope you guys make these. And if you do and I don't get to see them, please tweet me a picture of them. I love to see your artwork. And as always, have fun.